My in-laws have been bringing coffee uh, to Lethbridge and, and area for about uh, 10 to 15 years. They've been uh, investing in their farm. And um, I'd always enjoy when they bring it back because it is such special, special coffee. Um, it turned out to be the first time I actually went to Nicaragua that um, I saw the whole coffee process and realized that I wanted to get into it somehow. And uh, roasting coffee was kind of the, the thing that stuck out to me because uh, that was one of the processes that they didn't, never did. Um, so I had a friend who had a roaster. Uh, he lent me his roaster. I started roasting. I've been roasting coffee for about seven years now, uh, two and a half years for the company. And um, yeah, I, I love coffee. I love the whole process of uh, the coffee in Nicaragua. And that's really what uh, got everything going. All of our coffee is um, hand-picked and it's all sun-dried, which gives a lot, a lot of flavor to the coffee. Um, the hand-picking, you only pick what's ripe. So you don't pick over-ripe and you don't pick under-ripe. So that allows the coffee to be the best that it really can be. Um, we don't use any machinery uh, because our farm is on a natural reserve. So um, not only is the farm a beautiful place to be, but also it's a great um, ecosystem that uh, is in that area. So that's really, the fact that we are the farm sets us apart from everyone else. Um, most people are getting from a broker or something. So that is a kind of our special story.